Now at four, some local communities needing plows and shovels this morning, while others just waited on the rain to move in. Western Mass News reporter Leon Purvis joins us live from Blanford, where they received up to 10 inches of snow. Leon? Chris, people in Blanford are used to this amount of snow. Now, what they're are relieved about is the weather being above freezing temperatures to start melting the snow. Well, we, I expected it. So far, we've had a pretty mild winter. Uh, I didn't really expect this much, but, uh, you know, you can't tell. So we got it. So I just wanted to get it out of the way. Russell Taylor, or better known as Rick, woke up to more snow than he was anticipating. But what he is thankful for is the snow coming Monday, not Saturday or Sunday when temperatures were around zero degrees. Yesterday was brutal. And the day before it was very, very cold. Right, this isn't, it's warmed up. You know, this is nothing. One Blanford resident was planning to plow his neighbor's driveways, but he wasn't expecting the amount of snow his truck would have to move. I expected to be plowing today, but uh, not heavy, heavy snow like this. But for as when Chris Gibbs got started plowing? Uh, right about when it switched over to rain. Should have been on a little bit earlier, but uh, we slept in and we made the best of it. DPW crews in Blanford has spent all day long plowing and salting the roads. As on our way here, the roads are pretty clear. Now, coming up tonight on Western Mass News, hear from one animal hospital on how the snow impacted them today. For now, live in Blanford, Leon Purvis, Western Mass News.